Today, we're taking a look at my top five favorite video games. This video was honestly very interesting to make, and it asks one of the hardest questions ever. What are my favorite video games? It's like having to choose your favorite child. Even though it was difficult, I managed to do it to decide my top five favorite video games. And the results may surprise some of you, so make sure you stick around to the very end to see what took the place of number one. My fifth favorite video game is Minecraft. I really love to play this game with Grunty Bister and Mark Oni the Bold. I also enjoy playing this game with some of my other friends and also by myself. I think it's cool that every single time you play, you're having a different adventure. And it's so hard for me to last very long when I'm not playing with others in survival. Trust me. And in place number four is Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. Tech, I know that these are technically two games, but just, it's, it's fine, it counts as one, whatever. <laughs> as most of you probably know, I'm obsessed with Pokemon. But many of you might be surprised to learn that Pokemon Sword and Shield takes the place of number four, and not one or two. Anyway, Pokemon Sword and Shield are my current all-time favorite core franchise Pokemon games. They have all the past features that I love, and some new ones that are pretty awesome. The only feature that I wish they had that they don't is Mega Evolution. Other than that, I love these games so much, I really love the story of them, and the new Pokemon. And my third favorite video game is Stardew Valley. Can we please just take a moment to acknowledge that this game was made by one person? One person made this entire game, except the multiplayer stuff, but I'm not counting that. Eric Barone, aka Concerned Ape, made the art, made the code, and even made the sound effects. The thought of this blows me away. But anyway, I love this game so much. It's almost therapeutic. I often forget that I'm even playing a video game when I'm playing it. I get lost being the character and working hard on my farm. If I'm having a bad day, I play Stardew Valley and feel better. And my second place winner is Legends of Zelda Breath of the Wild. I only have four words. This game is amazing. Well, actually, I have a lot more than four words. Just stick with me here. This game is super fun, and I love how open world it is. And I love taking Link on this grand adventure and saving the world. <laughs> also, there's just so much you can do besides the main story. All the side quests and shrines and the, the, the photo quest Thing. Anyway, I'm still not done with the game, and I have over 100 hours of total gameplay on it. Then again, I do like to throw Link off of cliffs. So... yeah. And my number one favorite is Animal Crossing New Horizons. I love this game so much. It is so cute and relaxing. I love how chill it is, but there's still a storyline and mission type things for you to do. And real quick, I'm going to take a second to advertise here. On August 17th, 2020 is the first episode of my Animal Crossing New Horizons playthrough. So make sure to mark your calendars. I've never played before, and this is my very first ever core series Animal Crossing game. Anyway, back to the video you're on. <laughs> I love decorating my island and making plans for its future. Not only that, but Nate making new friends with the villagers that come to live slash visit my island is really fun. And that's why Animal Crossing New Horizons takes the place of my number one favorite. And with that comes the conclusion of this video. I really hope you enjoyed it, and feel free to share your favorite video games down below in the comments. And it doesn't just have to be your top 5, you can tell us your top 26, I don't care. <laughs> Make sure that you give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell for notifications. I really hope you enjoyed this videos and videos to come. This is Missy Doopop, signing off. <laughs>